y'all i'm rylan welcome to my channel I am currently sitting in the Barnes & Noble parking lot because, you know, where else would I be, right? I have been wanting to go to Barnes & Noble for the past few days, um, and today is the day that I decided to come. And I decided to, why not do a little, like, a bookstore shopping vlog while I'm here because content, right? And I love vlogs and I love watching other people go to the bookstore, so why not do it myself, you know? Um, I do have a few books that I'm looking for when I go in. I don't plan to buy a ton of books, like I'm just here for maybe three or four, so like I'm not gonna go overboard, but I really think it's a lot of fun to just kind of wander around Barnes & Noble, so I'm going to do a vlog of it so y'all can see what my local Barnes & Noble looks like and y'all can find some books with me. So yay! We're gonna go inside now and the vlog experience will begin. Okay. <laughs> This is a good book. I read it a few months ago and it was wonderful. Would recommend. stopping the video really fast to say that in this next clip I am not wearing a mask. I am fully vaccinated. There is technically no more mask mandate where I live, although I do generally wear one still. And I also made sure that there was nobody else around when I was filming this clip so nobody else felt uncomfortable with me doing it. So yeah, I just want to let y'all know before the clip pops up where I'm talking. Okay, so I have two books picked out right now. I currently have camp. Um, this is one of Barnes & Noble's monthly picks, and then I also have Blacktop Wasteland. 
this is another monthly pick so i would get a discount because it's like buy one get one 50 percent off so i'm leaning towards these two for sure um and i gotta figure out like what else i'm in the mood for because i know that i want something else and i don't know yet <laughs> what i want that to be i will buy junji ito manga someday but today is not gonna be that day <laughs> but they're so pretty <laughs> one but I'm kind of in love with the paperback edition but no no I have the hardback I need to not buy this one too but it's fine oh my gosh I've never seen Nick Cutter in bookstores before that was pretty good up buying two books which honestly i'm proud of myself because i needed to save money anyway i browsed around after i picked up these two and i just decided in the end that only getting two books was probably for the best but now that i'm back outside where the lighting is a lot better i figured i would go ahead and show y'all the two books that i did pick out uh first i got camp this is a young adult novel. I've had this book on my TBR for a few months now. I saw it on a YouTube video and I added it to my TBR and they are finally selling it in bookstores because for a while there I couldn't find it like in my Barnes and Noble. So I finally found it and I decided to buy it. The cover is so cute. I cannot wait to read it. Um, yeah, it's about these kids going to camp um, and it's a camp for queer teens. It's where our main character randy met his best friends stuff like that so it's gonna be really fun i think like outdoorsy campy ya book so i'm very excited for this one then i also got blacktop wasteland this and camp were both the monthly picks for june for barnes and noble so you got them buy one get one 50 percent off so i was like obviously this is a thriller Yeah, a thriller about this man named Bug, who, like, I guess used to be a really, like, famous getaway driver for, like, all these crimes that happened, but he turned his life around, except that he gets, like, asked to do this, like, huge, like, jewelry heist, I believe, and he can't say no to it, so he ends up trying to be the getaway driver again, I guess, and stuff goes wrong. yeah it sounds really good i have not seen this on instagram yet or booktube yet but i think the book might have just come out so i am expecting 
to see it around more in the next few weeks. I'll probably go ahead and post about it on my Instagram soon because it sounds really good. Might read it in the next few weeks or so. Not sure yet. But yeah, those were the two books that I got. I am very much looking forward to reading both of these books. I think they're going to be great. So I... Yeah, I'm glad that I picked them up when I came to Barnes & Noble and I saved some money because discounts and I didn't buy a third book, so also saving money. Um, but yeah, okay. The car just drove by and they're probably like, why are you talking to yourself? It's fine though, it's okay. But anyway, yeah, so I hope y'all enjoyed this little bookstore shopping vlog. Um, yeah, you get to see the inside of my car. It is wonderful, I guess, I don't know. So this is my local Barnes & Noble. I love coming here every few weeks to just kind of browse around because the bookstore is my home and I love it here. I'm glad y'all were able to join me on this little bookstore vlog experience. I hope y'all enjoyed. Um, I have nothing else to say. Um, I might do more of these in the future because this was really fun. I love book shopping. I love book shopping in person. So I'm glad that I was able to do this. If you like this video, please like and subscribe for more content. I hope y'all like the fact that I was sitting in my car versus like my apartment because, you know, change of scenery, right? Because I totally could have introduced this vlog in a very more formal manner. But here we are. Um, so yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank y'all so much once again for watching and I will see y'all in another video.